You're AJ Dua with the 48th OSS and the 492nd Fighter Squadron. This is currently my second time uh, at Inyohos uh, 2022. Um, my first time was back in 2016, uh, based out of here at, at, at Andrew Vita. For most part, they're the same uh, as far as the desired learning objectives. Uh, the airspace is relatively similar. The players, uh, for the most part, are similar. I think there's a couple more added countries, so the Canadians, as far as C2 goes, as well as the Slovenians being here. Um, so outside of those two, uh, for the most part, the same players, uh, same type of mission sets, uh, just more um, variants as far as aircraft. I've been a fighter pilot now for about nine, to nine years. Uh, so April 2013 was our first flight in the F-15E. I've uh, been flying it ever since. As far as the day-to-day um, -day operations, uh, we've got three uh, missionized uh, vulnerability periods, or vols we call them, uh, that we plan to. Uh, that's the big mission planning between all the countries, uh, taking off at different times of the day, plus a side mission, so a little bit more of a, uh, just a continuity training between the, the countries out here. Uh, not as formal as the MPCs. As far as the mission sets that we've been flying, uh, they've been a predominance of air interdiction, uh, so think air to ground strike, uh, the suppression of enemy air defenses, so thinking uh, surface to air missile takedown from the air, um, combat search and rescue, uh, some maritime operations, um, as well as some um, air to air escort to ensure that we can get to the players in. Um, each vol is a little bit different as far as the mission set and the priority, but for the most part, those are the, the things we've centered around our uh, um, what we've been doing around here. We've been flying with obviously the Hellenic Air Forces and a you know large predominance of their aircraft are here. Um, we've had the Israelis last week, uh, this as well as the Italians, and then we've also had the Slovenians and then Canadian C2 controllers here uh, as well as ourselves. The thing for me is seeing uh, this country. It's kind of ancient history with like warriors thinking about Athens, Greece, Sparta, etc. and being able to fly in those same mountains uh, around the Peloponnese, uh, seeing the hot gates uh, from the air and then you know traveling on the ground. Um, it, it's been pretty cool and eye-opening um, for the most part and uh, yeah it's been pretty cool. The biggest piece of advice I'd give to um, guys and girls that are coming to a new host next year for uh, 23, first off take advantage of the MPC opportunities that you have uh, to plan with the actual your NATO partners. Uh, do a of learning from them, kind of listen to what they have to say, and then just, you know, still share your piece of advice that you have for the tactical solution to the problem that you have at hand. Um, but for the most part, it is a learning experience between both countries because obviously uh, they have a different threat that they usually trade against to, uh, a different way of thinking, vice what we do. But for the most part, I think that there's been good learning going on to and from. Um, and they've obviously been receptive, and we have been too, to learning from each other. We have you know multiple aircraft. Uh, Multiple platforms. We, we usually see this like similar to a red flag, where you go somewhere and you you see other Americans are flying different platforms, and and you know you walk in and I'm an F-15 guy, that's an F-16 guy. You know we we have a slight uh, rivalry, if you will. Um, it's the same that holds true here. Uh, just the fact that they're Greek uh, or Hellenic or Israeli or Slovenian, etc. Um, I, I think it's pretty cool that you have people that all have relatively speaking the same type of personality, the same type of. Uh, drive to get the mission done, whether it be a different method uh, or a different point of view. Um, and you learn and appreciate those guys uh, more so just by sharing the fact that you've been planning and flying with each other. Um, so the, f the friendships come very, very quickly, um, as well as the knowledge of each other's capabilities, which is actually uh, pretty cool to see uh, after a week long of mission planning and just kind of hanging out with the guys and girls.